has officially released the first update to the 7.1 series, VirtualBox 7.1.2. It brings a host of fixes and improvements to the popular virtualization software, aiming to enhance stability and performance across various platforms. To begin with, the GUI has received several notable updates. Multiple window layout and translation related issues have been addressed, ensuring a smoother user experience in different languages. Additionally, a previous issue that prevented virtual machine created using the unattended install feature from being removed cleanly has been fixed. Users will also find a new option to change the remote display security method, providing more flexibility in configuring secure remote connections. Furthermore, the Vator label has been removed from the macOS ARM UI, indicating its readiness for production use. Moving on, network functionality has seen significant enhancement. The network address translation feature now offers better performance on Windows host, resolving slow network speeds. Moreover, DHCP problems with certain West systems when the domain file is empty have been fixed, ensuring reliable network configuration for PM in terms of, of graphics, several 3D acceleration issues have been resolved, specifically enabling 3D acceleration in VM settings no longer causes problems, and black screen issues affecting Windows VMs have been addressed. Additionally, rendering glitches caused by incorrect view handling have been corrected. Notably, the update introduced the ability to enable 3D acceleration for ARM platform VMs, expanding support and improving performance on a wider range of hardware configuration. The Guest Control Manager has also been updated to fix a problem loading saved states created by version 7.0.x, ensuring compatibility and seamless translation between versions. Furthermore, the API has been refined to fix issues with incorrect handling of the MVRAM state with the legacy BIOS and its removal upon VM deletion. It also addressed querying the UEFI secure boot state where the VM was never started, enhancing the reliability of API interactions. Lastly, the guest additions package has been updated to fix an error message that appeared during aromatic upgrading, improving the overall user experience. SDK received a fix for the building code using the XPCOM binding.